Initially, when I was 34 years old, I was vice president of a construction company, and I started experiencing quite a few headaches. Uh, I thought they were stress-related. As time went on, the headaches picked up in frequency. I started having visual issues. I was actually taking a shower one day, and while taking a shower, saw a kaleidoscope of colors, you know, kind of like going through Las Vegas, you know, uh, like you see on TV, where it's just a blur of colors. These episodes, uh, what we call them at that time, picked up in frequency. When we found out it was a brain tumor, that really scared the heck out of my wife and I. Uh, being 34 years old at the time, the father of four boys, we didn't know what to do. We didn't know, really know what options were available. All we knew at that point in time is we wanted the best possible treatment that we could receive, you know, to try to spare my life. We found out that the brain tumor was actually cancerous. It was a uh, grade two uh, brain cancer. And, uh, you know, we went to several doctors and actually found Dr. Linda Leao out here at UCLA who had developed an experimental brain cancer vaccine uh, manufactured by Northwest Biotherapeutics called DC Vax. Uh, they had their people come to our lab to kind of see how we were making the vaccine and, uh, and uh, extrapolate that to, uh, a, you know, a clinical product uh, that could be produced in uh, mass quantities to, you know, provide for, uh, other centers. Uh, in order to, uh, to do this trial at other places. The injections were actually you know, quite simple. It's just like getting a flu shot or a, you know, a mumps, you know, mumps or measles shot in the arm. And after that, uh, you know, there was no other treatment. I went through that process for one year. Beyond that, that that's the only treatment. Unlike the side effects of other standard of care treatments, uh, being chemotherapy, radiation, things like that, that have very debilitating side effects with the uh, nausea, with the fatigue, with the DCVAX uh, treatment protocol, there is you know, there is no fatigue, there's no nausea, there's no you know debilitating side effects, there's no toxicity with the treatment. So I was able to actually go on with my daily activities, uh, which you know involved you know spending time with the kids, playing you know playing with the kids, throwing a baseball with my son. You know there was none of this you know resting, laying on the couch. Uh, you were able to go on with you know daily activities. The way DCVAX works, it actually is designed to prevent brain tumor reoccurrence because with brain cancer, there's such a high rate of reoccurrence and each time it comes back, it comes back more aggressively. The DC Vax for the past two years has kept me cancer free. There's no sign of the tumor and for two years now I've been cancer free. I just arrived at LAX and on the way to interview with NBC Extra show uh, over at UCLA. UCLA has uh, made contact with Extra to try to promote the vaccine. The purpose of the trip is to raise awareness of brain cancer and let people know that there's a life-saving vaccine that exists out there. The general public and many doctors and patients across the nation don't even realize that these treatments exist. Uh, so it's important that people realize that the treatment options are out there before they make a decision on their, t uh, on their therapy because if uh, brain tumor is removed without, uh, you know, without being saved and stored properly, then uh, there, there can't be a vaccine made and they're back to relying on standard of care treatments which give you uh, 14 and a half months to live. This is a personalized vaccine. We actually make it specifically from the patient's own brain tumor tissue in combination with the patient's own blood cells that we grow together with the brain tumor tissue uh, or brain tumor uh, proteins so that the immune system could be uh, activated. Uh, currently, the, the, uh, the phase one trials that we've conducted have shown some promising results in, in uh, several patients uh, with, uh, with malignant gliomas. Uh, you know, the prognosis of this disease is very poor and, and for some patients uh, we're seeing some very you know, prolonged survivals. Dr. Leao is a reason that I'm still alive today. You know, she with her vaccine has saved my life. You know, I'm here two years later, still cancer free, healthy, uh, vibrant, energetic, and uh, you know, ready to take on the world. My wife and I have dedicated our lives to finding better treatments for brain, you know, for brain cancer patients. We have seen most of the clinical trials that exist out there We've seen several other brain cancer vaccines and every piece of information that we have seen proves that this one works far beyond the capabilities of the other vaccines. Technically, I should be dead not sitting here giving this testimonial right now. This is not a paid endorsement. I'm living proof. The organization believes so firmly in it. We dedicate our lives to raising awareness and funding so that others have access to this vaccine.